it's been quite a few years since the Dolphins Girls had won in Mackay. So to go there um, and get a win to start the season was very pleasing. And then to back it up the next day uh, against a, probably the strongest outfit you're probably going to face this year in Townsville. With Kayla George in it, um, I thought the girls showed an incredible amount of grit and fight to only go down by six points. Oh, I mean, I haven't really paid attention to so much what any other team is doing, but I can just speak on behalf of my group and um, the willingness and uh, wanting to get better every day has been fantastic. And the fact that, you know, you can draw up plays on the board and they can execute them straight out of a timeout and uh, out of half times and quarter times is quite pleasing and uh, satisfying. Um, but obviously we've got a lot of WNBL girls running around the competition. Uh, we don't have any in our team, but, um, you know, we, we battle above our weight class, that's for sure, and uh, hopefully uh, shock a few teams this year. We gave them Tuesday off, uh, so back at it tonight and then a few solid hit outs before we lead into Brisbane. Um, this week is solely about us and what we need to do better from the weekend um, and we'll have a better look at Brisbane probably closer to Thursday and uh, see how they go over this weekend as well. i probably develop my own style of coaching. Um, I've been fortunate throughout my playing career to have a number of great coaches and, uh, you know, from Mike Dunlap to Gorgian to Anstey to Joey Wright to Fernie now uh, and Al Westover. I mean, the amount of coaching I've got throughout the years is just a whole world of knowledge and for me it's probably more simplifying than complicating um, what we're doing and um, trying to find out who I am as a coach along the way. coach I'm no different to what I am as a player and that's to win um, obviously we went one and one on the weekend but under the circumstances it was very pleasing to see uh, the fight and determination that the girls showed and um, I'd much rather be not having to coach that you know that's a luxury for myself and more worried about what we're doing next to the team uh, technically uh, gives me huge amount of confidence with the girls that we've got moving forward and what we're head towards building this year.